Good morning, everyone. It's Monday. I uh, just came back from a recent trip in Sugarloaf, USA. And actually, something drew my attention this weekend, not only with uh, the, the type of liquid that we're drinking, but I think one of the biggest scam of all time, the biggest liquid scam of all time, and one of the most dangerous calories is a sweetener. And I'll explain to you why. Uh, a lot of people are drinking water or sweetened water, mineral water, smart water, which I don't think it's really that smart. And they basically buy it because it tastes sweet. And I do admit it tastes much better than average liquids. The problem with that is that that one calorie, that sweetener, actually um, increase your appetite. Many researchers now will say it's a toxin. And actually, there's a lot of debate out there. One thing we know for sure, it does increase your appetite. You're more likely to put weight on. It stimulates your appetite for carbohydrates, so you always have that craving. Uh, and there's just no benefits for drinking it. And it influences your palate, your receptors, that enables you to taste food and make food taste delicious. So it takes about three weeks to four weeks to go off those sweeteners until you can really start tasting foods like strawberries. Many times I suggest my clients to eat berries and they find there's no taste to it. And this time of year it could be true, but there really is no taste for them because they use so much sweeteners. So I suggest you to Google or search the health concerns with sweeteners. And I think that will convince you right now. If you really want to sweet or put something in your water, one of the best thing I would suggest, I just did it this morning and it takes um, one second. Cut a lemon in half, splash some water into it. It helps for digestion. It's good for your liver. It's good for your kidney. Uh, it helps remove uh, radiation from the blood. It's a blood cleanser, and there's so many other benefits for immune system. So again, I hope I can convince you. Start basically reducing the things that drives you to crave more food. Sweeteners, we need to cut it out. If you're gonna have sugar, may as well go with real sugar, real maple syrup, real honey, like real honey, uh, and uh, sugar cane, but use very little of it. So here's my tip for Monday. And again, take the pledge, eliminate those sweeteners. Go natural.